Hey guys, it's your girl Precious here and I'm back again with another video. Welcome to my Summer Diaries episode 3, I think? I don't know. I don't know if this is going to be a Summer Diaries, y'all. Yeah. I'm happy. I don't know. Today has been feeling good. I had a little talk with an influencer group chat. Well, I wasn't talking. I just finished reading the messages. They had a good talk. I don't know. That group chat, I love that group chat so much. Yeah, go check them out. I'm gonna link the um, the group chat down below, and they're gonna be in the comments, so you can always just check them out. But that group chat has really motivated me, and I'm loving it. Okay, but yeah, so I, I look rough, but it's a maintenance vlog, so your girl is probably looking fly by the end of this video. I'm about to do my hair, lashes, nails, and some self care, and possibly I'm gonna journal. I just have some minor like. I'm gonna answer some questions, so a little Q and A. Um, and yeah, is it online? Anyways, um, I was supposed to talk to y'all about something. Okay, so your girl was in a little slump. Okay, I don't know if y'all noticed. Like, I took a little week off. I didn't post on Monday, and then I didn't post on Saturday. That's my posting schedule, by the way, for um summer. I might change it up. I think I might post Wednesday. I don't know, because I feel like Saturday and Monday is way too close for my liking. So I might change it to like Tuesday and Saturday. Mm, I don't know, I'm going to keep the, I'm gonna keep the posting schedule. But I went for a little slump. I don't know, I don't know what happened. Okay, so if you know me, you know I don't like filming in my room because the color. But it's fine. But it's so hot because it's raining off and on. So like, you know, yeah. At one point it's cold. Then when it rain stops, it's hot. Then it's just extremely hot. Then it going back to rain. Like, just, just do one thing. If you're gonna rain, rain. Okay. Damn. But let me show you the style I'm gonna be doing. It's a style that I did in October. I feel like this is so cute. What is it? Oh. I feel like this is so cute and it would definitely eat for summer. I wish I had some headbands. I feel like that would eat with headbands. But yeah. And if you don't know, follow me on Instagram. So you could be like a part of any like question, like Q&A that I do. My Instagram is who's that precious. It's going to be linked down below. So yeah. Um, I'll probably come back to the vlog when I'm doing my hair or like after my hair is done and then we're gonna go into doing the, um, the lashes and then my nails and then we're gonna possibly journal and then the Q&A so yeah and make sure you guys like comment share and subscribe because I have so much content coming for um, summer like I understand today's July 21st but Hey um, so I got my hair done. I feel like it's cute. I'm about to take some pictures, videos, yeah. I was gonna make some noodles, but it's kind of almost dinner time, so I don't want to make something. And then, by the time I finish, my mother start cooking dinner, and then it will be ready. So, yeah. Right now it's 3:43. Ooh, I'm supposed to post a reel today on uh, TikTok. So I'm probably gonna get that done, and then I'm gonna come back to y'all when I'm doing my lashes. And then I think I'm gonna paint my toes, but like. Maybe not today. So maybe I'll do my toes tomorrow. I love the thing about it. Y'all not gonna see my toes though because mm -mm. no. But yeah, I feel cute. I feel very cute. And I'm about to go take some pictures, take some videos. So yeah, I'm gonna catch y'all when I'm doing my lashes. Hey y'all. Uh, right now it's four or six. I'm not too sure when I started my hair, but it took a good bit, I think. Um I don't know, I don't know if this is ghetto, but I'm about to do my lashes in this mirror. So, yeah. I was going to do this in the bathroom, but no. So, yeah. 
So I'm doing it here. I'm gonna go get this stuff, and then y'all gonna watch me do my um, lashes, and then I'm gonna do my edges because I realized my sister didn't do them. I have a big head, but I still look good. So yeah, let me go get the lashes and the stuff that I need. I have a fan here, so when I come back, y'all gonna hear the fan because it's really hot. But yeah, I'll be back. I'm back, but before I do my lashes, I wanna fill my water bottle. Reminder, stay hydrated. I'm gonna tell y'all this in every vlog. Stay hydrated. Because it's so hot. I swear that cover was open. Am I tripping? But yeah, it's so hot and like just stay hydrated. I'm gonna put some ice and water in my bottle. I'm gonna be grateful for the amount that I got. Which wasn't that much to be honest. Yeah. It's fine. Water is always going to be good. But it depends. It depends on the brand I feel like. Because some water brands, like, they water don't be, I don't know, it be weird. I'm not even going to go into that because that's going to be like a whole yapping session. But anyways, I'm going to go do my lashes, so let's go. I hope the fan isn't too loud. I go, is it on low? I go home off the fan for now. Let me just get a good camera angle. Should I do it like here and then? Like here, y'all. Yeah, this is not even ghetto. I just realized, oh, like, is this ghetto? This is my house, okay? This is my home, my lovely home. And I bought my meals out here, too. Dang. Did I even bring? Oh, it's on chair. Okay, and I my lip glasses on outside. Okay. Now that's ghetto. I don't even know where my lip glasses are for real. Anyways, this is the lashes that I use. Um magnetic. Okay, I'm gonna just put the name on the screen because what? I don't even know, but this one is so much better than the one with glue. Any lash set with um any lash kit without glue is good. With the seal and the bond, that's good. Um, I'm probably gonna go on Pinterest real quick to find um, a lash map that I wanna do. I might do cat eye, to be honest. So let me find a good one on Pinterest and I'm gonna come back to y'all. Okay y'all, so I found one off of Pinterest. It's something simple. Most of them had in like 14, not 14, but like 15 or 16, which I don't really like that one. Let me show y'all my 15 and 16. Like, they're super duper long. Like, these? Mm -mm, nope. Can't do it. I ain't never used a 16 before, and I don't like the... Like, I don't like how long it is. Not for me. Maybe for my mom, because she want me to do hers, but... I don't know. I'm not that good yet, because I be poking myself in the eyes, so I don't want to poke nobody. But, this is the one that I'm doing. Something slight, something simple. It's just 10, 11, 12, 13, and 12. I think for me, I'm gonna have to double one of them. But we're gonna see. So yeah, let's put some music and let's vibe to be honest. I could do the QA right now, but I need to focus, so I can't do it. I'm gonna put a camera right here. Cause I need to come up closer because I can't see. Okay, what type of music do you wanna listen to? Like hot girl type music, you know? Hot girl type music.
Okay, so yeah, lashes is done. I like how they came out, but I kind of messed up with one of these in the front. So, yeah. And then the end one just keep coming up. And then I have an eyelash that just down. So we don't talk about that. But I gotta stop doing these um, lash, lash extensions because my lashes are going bye-bye. Okay. So right now it is 4.49. I didn't really take that long, I think. No, I did. Was it 3 o'clock? I don't know. But I'm gonna take a little break. To be honest, I've been doing a lot for the whole day. I'm not gonna post on um, Instagram and TikTok today, just cause. But I probably I'm gonna do my nails, and I'm gonna take a break. Yeah, because I wanna film some TikToks, and then yeah, I need to take a picture for the thumbnail of my eyelashes. So hopefully they look good. Mm, yeah, this maintenance vlog is just kind of I don't know. This is one of my unorganized vlogs because I really just woke up and I was like, let's just have a maintenance day. Because my sister will let she undo my hair. And I was like, okay. And I was like, I'm going to do my lashes and my nails today and I'm going to film it. And I was like, I'm going to have a little Q&A. So yeah. But I'm going to edit it really good. But I'm going to go do my, um, I'm going to go do my nails right now. So yeah. She bought a flat man on her She bought a tape in her hand. This cat nigga can't even see me on your hands. She fought a flight nigga in this sky. She fought a flight man on way out of here. She fought a flight nigga can't even see me on way out of here. I'm too far in the sky. Heard me his ass for the dark, my ass. Bitch, so pretty, look better than Cassie. Puffin' on Zooters and she callin' me daddy. Walkin' on shit, turn it up and I guess. Came out the gutter, they ain't never me to swag it. Secure the bag, got a bitch, I'm a bag it. Turnin' it up, got a ratchet, she good. Parkin' two million and build up my hood. Drinkin' no mud, I made out of the sewer. Grow hard and sense me, do that one good. How did these niggas, they lookin' the same. They copy my lingo, they bite Okay, y'all, so my nails are done. I was gonna point a pink one, but I was like, let me just point a blue. Even though I point a blue like eight times already, nobody cares. To be honest, it's my press-ons. Yeah, I need to get some more. Cause press-ons for me is very like simple, easy. I can work with it. Cause you know I be playing the guitar. Where my guitar? I be playing the guitar. So like I pop these off, play, it, and I put them back on. The pink. That one was going through it. Okay, I had to scrape off the um the glue, and it wasn't coming off. So I'm probably gonna soak it. I don't know. I'm probably gonna find a way to like take off the gorilla glue easy. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to do my edges. But yeah, hair done, nails done, everything did. I'm probably gonna have a little self-care night tonight and then I'm gonna answer questions for y'all. Or I might just have a little sit down and answer questions. I might just have a little sit down and then self-care. And then I think tomorrow what I want to do because having a maintenance day isn't only about like what's on the outside, it's about what's on the inside as well. So I really want to journal tomorrow. I want to do some stuff tomorrow. Get my life together. So yeah, today was like the outside. The nails, the lashes, the hair. I didn't do my eyebrows because I feel like I have good eyebrows. Even though I have a little thing that will never leave y'all. That's forever. But some people say they can't really see it so I don't really bring that up. But yeah, so I'm, I'm gonna put my camera battery to charge and then we're we gonna have a little sit down. Yeah, we're gonna have a little sit down. Hopefully. Hey guys, as you can tell, it's the next day, June 22nd. I don't know if I told y'all, but yesterday was June 21st. Today's June 22nd. As you can tell, I didn't journal yesterday, I didn't do the questions, and then I didn't show y'all me doing like skincare and whatnot. So. Right now, I'm going to do the Q&A, and then later today, I'm going to journal. I didn't do the questions yesterday because, I'm not going to lie, I was very tired. I did my nails. This one, well, okay, three of them came off because I was washing dishes, and then they just came off. It's fine. I have to go to dinner tonight, so I'm going to put it back on. And then, like, one, one of my eyelashes here came off, and then, like, one on the outside of here. But, yeah, you can see it. It's fine, okay? You can easily put them back on. But yeah, right now it's 3.19. I am going to go dinner at like 
late four o'clock or like five maybe i don't know but i did get some more questions for the q a well it's not really a q a well yeah it's a q a but like it's just questions about like self-care youtube jersey maybe school stuff like that so first question first question is are you excited for sophomore year if you know me you know i always talking about sophomore year i am so excited because new content even though it's going to be like the same back to school um season type videos new content buddy new mindset new everything i'm trying stuff new and just meeting new people to be honest as well for sophomore year and the influencer group chat we have a lot planned for sophomore year we're then already planning um videos for sophomore year we're trying to do some stuff together so just know i see you aka influencer come up gc we're gonna be lit so make sure you follow the page on instagram my point right here follow it on instagram and then follow everybody as well because our content is top notch 10 out of 10 boo boo are you gonna be doing youtube for all of high school that's definitely my goal hopefully nothing happened like an next pandemic or whatnot but even if that were to happen which i pray don't we can't do i can't do it again i can't i already missed my sixth grade graduation i can't do it again and for senior year a lot of content for senior year because that's my last year in high school and college is gonna come up i'll see if i go to college to be honest but i do plan on doing youtube all of high school so how did you get comfortable with recording in public how did I get comfortable? Mm, I would definitely say, okay, I'm not gonna say that I am fully like 10 out of 10 comfortable with vlogging in public. It depends on where I go to a vlog, to be honest. Like, I can vlog in a hair store, I can vlog in stores, but like I cannot vlog like at fair where so much people is. Like, I can't just have my camera in my hand just vlogging like that. No. But how I got comfortable with vlogging in public, I would definitely say it was like, I'm trying to have this mindset of who cares like life you're always gonna have haters in your life to be honest people always gonna judge you people always gonna be hating they'll be wishing bad on your dreams and I was like I don't care about I don't care about that I don't care about people like that so like let me just care about my dreams and then I was like let me just stop vlogging in public more so I definitely want to have like 10 hours of 10 vlogging skills in public but as I right now I don't feel like it's going to happen, but I still have that mindset and I still do vlog like if I'm with my friends, I'll definitely vlog, but I can't vlog with myself, you know? Okay, this question is, what is it like being a young YouTuber? I mean, I don't really know how to like answer this question because to be honest, I don't know. I mean, okay, sometimes it's like very nerve wracking to be honest because like, you know people like us, young people. They're always quick to judge, they're always quick to make fun of you, always quick to add you to the group chat, talking about you. And I mean, like, that's the same with adults as well. Anyways, as I was saying, it's the same with adults, but like, I feel like, you know, you're a kid, your mindset is very, like, different, you know, like, I don't really know how to explain it, but like, yeah. But it is a very, like, good feeling, to be honest, like, exclude all the negative whatnot i feel like definitely for something that you want to do it's very amazing because it's like you're gonna find people like you you're gonna find people that have the same mindset as you and you're gonna meet new people definitely if i would say if you have like anxiety in person it's very easier to talk to somebody online maybe so yeah okay so what inspired you to start youtube this is something that I always um, wanted to do when I was younger. Like, I used to vlog on an iPad before. I had my whole camera and whatnot. Like, I was like, oh, like eight, to be honest. Like, I think so. I was eight. And I remember, like, just vlogging or, like, you would be in the bathroom, the mirror in front of you, I would be like, hey guys, I'm back. I'm going to be doing skincare. And it's something that I always wanted to do. But. Like, what motivated, I'm gonna just add a little something, but like, what motivated me to continue doing YouTube, definitely like, my dreams, because I definitely want to be successful in life, and 
YouTube is like kind of a job because you can make money on it. And I'm like, I can be making money from a young age, save that, put that towards my college to get like a better job or whatnot. Like, you know, gotta think about the future. Um, share with, um second part for the question. And then what is your biggest tip for a beginner? My biggest tip for a beginner, okay, I know I have a camera and it's very good to have a camera because editing on your phone and recording on your phone is very hard. But if you know that you don't have the money to buy an expensive camera like Canon or Sony, there's other cameras out there that you can get or there's other ways on how to edit on your phone and save storage on your phone, you know? Um, so definitely you do not have to follow the trends with getting a camera because people always talking about some, you know, oh get a camera, better quality, whatnot. You're gonna know when you're ready to get a camera. Um a second tip, because I wanna give two. Um a second tip I would definitely say think about your future before you're like, oh everybody's talking about me or they're making fun of me because I have a YouTube channel. If this is something that you want to do blanco everybody don't care about anybody opinion because the only opinion that matter is yours and anybody else like own us positive I feel like don't worry about a negative because if you want to do anything any job comes with a negative side okay any job comes with a negative side um like you could be a businesswoman and like one day there's always gonna be somebody that don't like you you know same thing with YouTube one day you might get hate comments, but then you're going to also get positive comments. So definitely don't care about what anybody have to say. Do you? And then same with my first um, tip. You do not have to have a camera. Okay? Some people will stop posting on YouTube just because they don't have a camera. If you really want to make it, you're going to do everything that you can to make it. Because I know this person, she stopped posting on YouTube and you want to know why? It's because she don't have a camera what mama there's so much stuff that you could be doing you could be vlogging somewhere right now okay you could be vlogging for somewhere right now your video could be hit your video could be a hit you could get your watch time hours this summer you could get the subscribers that you need this summer but you're letting not have a camera stop you next question okay last and final question please ignore the dogs i don't know i think people are passing Okay, so last and final question is, what is a skincare brand that you would like to work with? So, let's really think about this. What's a skincare brand that I would like to work with? Maybe CeraVe, to be honest. CeraVe, Cetaphil, or like more Korean brands, I feel like. Because I'm definitely going into my Korean skincare era, and I feel like it's definitely helping on my skin. I am breaking up because I am going through like a little purging stage. But I have these like Korean products that God sent to me. They was amazing. But I don't know. Let me look up skincare brands. I be forgetting names. I am not good with names at all. Like Bubble was number one because I wanted Bubble for Christmas. I didn't get Bubble for Christmas. And look at me being a brand ambassador for Bubble. But yeah, that was the end of the Q&A. And I hope you guys enjoyed this maintenance vlog. I'm probably going to have like a little cute... um. Probably gonna have a little cute montage at the end. So, yeah. Um, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Bye, guys.